guys, guys. Should I just keep this going? Yeah, you know what? We're riding off the energy. Imagine we are FaceTiming because basically we are. I just got off the phone with my bestie and I did something that I did not realize I was going to do until my heart and soul was like, bitch. I wonder if I wanna have these on so I like feel better about myself. Is this a vibe? Is this okay? Anyways, so I, wow, I just touched my hair three times in like 40 seconds. Four seconds. <laughs> Salud. Excuse me. That might have been, sorry, we're working on our online matters. So where was I? I did something that I didn't think I was going to do until it was done. And I've been really feeling into it. I've been seeing posts about it and really like processing like being celibate and oh fuck I just anyways my stomach I sh should eat something okay we're gonna get a snack beer because I think might be on the boycott list, but I'm also hungry. And so like, I'm not gonna starve. Like I already bought it, you know, it was just like in my fridge. And I'm like sad about it because I love these bars. Also, I don't wanna promote anything. Oh, what? It's not being perfect, it's about your hair brush. So, well, this really gets like in there. Mm. <sighs> Anyways, I just. <laughs> wash it down with some Zoa. It's not sponsored, but I'd be into it. <laughs> mm. Excuse me. So where was I? Oh my gosh, my mom is video timing me right now, but like I literally were in a vibe. Me and you, we're here together. Hey mom, what's up? Hello? Hello? Hi. Well, I'm gonna ask Marcia to join us. Okay. I'll get back. I'll get back. Oh my god, my mom is so cute. So, where was I? Oh, and what's cute is that like, we're like close to each other like proximity wise and we still like call each other like fuck it whatever we don't want to leave our rooms it's fine i've been hermiting i've been hermiting with the <laughs> oh my gosh i don't know why i'm like so nervous about saying words that might be portrayed in a certain way but like if you know you know and this is healing and i've like 
literally not left my house other than for two instances and they were very brief they were anyways i've basically been hermiting for almost a week and i decided to facetime my friend who goes through similar experiences with me and we are we we're talking about like people that we're attracted to and like silly stories about crushes and stuff and just like oh. and then it turned into a freaking ceremony well i mean it was like a brief one but we're gonna see each other tonight and i realized like oh shisa i need to be seven months celibate like this is and by seven months we have decided 30 days which is because it the freaking calendar i am i don't even understand i don't even understand the calendar how some months are 31 some of them are not and they're not even like 31 30 31 <clears throat> anyways i made this commitment and i am like excited about it um i've been celibate for nine months before and that was really special i did intend for a year but you know then some near-death experiences happened and then i was like you never know you never hmm. anyways <laughs> so i feel like i can do seven months this time all that to say um and i'm like excited because I feel like I really do want to put pour this energy into myself and my heart and my soul. And I want to like make my dreams come true before I even think about <laughs> Irene. Tell me why I am celibate and I'm still considering spending $400 on a flight to see someone for two days, one month after I met them. Like literally, I did not even experience sex with this person, but like the vibes were vibing and like, I just kind of want to do that more. Any hoodles, this is why we're going celibate, Aria. And I talked to myself, I was like, there is seven more months out of this year. And are you, you know what? I feel like what would be necessary is a drink, so. I, I non-alcoholic we will discuss this after but I feel like also I might just go I might just go no alcohol during these months because I, I feel like alcohol might be influencing my decisions I don't know I'm, I'm like thinking about going cold turkey on the vices you know what I mean I've already basically stopped smoking vapes because I saw the freaking cobalt mines that are happening in congo and i was like yikes whoa. whoa but um yeah i just like feel like because of my dehydration that i experienced last weekend because your girl was not taking care of herself and drinking water while she was drinking alcohol these things happen and then we like we process life we talk about it with our girlies and then we're like oh shit maybe we should just go on a seven month celibacy thing so now we're here now we're here cheers to making choices so i got some goals goals are to release a song <laughs> we're gonna go on a tangent but it relates you want to come you want to come on this tangent with me okay so yesterday i hopped on my friend Taifi's live stream and I just decided to hop on because I know that we're in different time zones Turns out they're in Saudi Arabia and I'm in Hawaii. So that's like a whole 14 hours It was like so spontaneous and he just like calls me out. He's like, hey, Aria, are you here? Like invites me to be on his live. I'm like, whoa, and then we like get into this whole vortex of this song that I am desiring to release on 888 and uh 888 it's like august 8th 2024 and he was like why and i like i feel like it looks like a butterfly <laughs> i feel like it looks like anyways so i like i feel called to share it on that date and it sucks because not sucks 
but uh, I've tried to release a song and it only um it actually like released early i don't know i think i did distro kid wrong and it oh god i <sighs> promoting freaks me out but do you want to hear it we're gonna do a little preview and like if you want to hear more or if you want to help me promote this song please help me <laughs> this i'm laughing through the pain really like yikes but this song is like so near and dear to me and I really want to like promote it better than I did my first song because I had no idea what I was doing. Like for real talk. Um, thanks for your patience. Oh, not me getting nervous. <laughs> Okay, let's give it up for the people who choose to slow fade so that it's not just like a jump. It's like a, you feel me? Slow, slow like that. So that's the song. And I happened to like hop with him on his live stream while we we're just like reminiscing. And that was, that was wild. That was like, yeah, I just, I remembered how much that song means to me whilst talking to Taifi, the person who helped me produce the song. And I'm just like so excited, but this wasn't meant to be a, like, it wasn't meant, this wasn't meant to be a promo for that song, but that's one of my goals. So I really want to do that. My other dream is to make my passports like verified and all that stuff. It's a long story. I might get into it. It's a very important story that needs to be said about passport probations. <sighs> Anyways, and so I could travel to the Ada Awakening Festival happening in September. And I'm turning 30 in November, so I think it would be really cool to give myself the present on November 19th of being celibate for seven months. Oh my God, I'm so nervous, I'm so nervous. I'm nervous because I enjoy it. I enjoy sexual experiences. Sex, sex jewel, obviously. <laughs> and I, the last time I did this was in 2017. So it's been some years. It's been seven years. So I'm gonna honor that by doing seven months. Oh my God, perfect, perfect. <laughs> Anyways, I think it helps that I'm doing it with my bestie who is doing it for health reasons. And she made me gasp for air. Like, <laughs> she's like, let's be clear. 
if I did not have to do this for health reasons, like I would, this would be such a fun summer. And I was like, babe, it's okay. She was like, what the fuck? Like you're doing this by choice. <laughs> so that's happening. I feel like I'm like talking about this with you and like, I'm really like gonna like upload it so that I am accountable to myself. And also I feel like it'll just like filter out the people who love me for me. Um, when I reflect on the nine months of being celibate, I really experienced people who like wanted to get to know me as a person. So I would love that. That would be so fun. So nice. <laughs> Clearly I'm freaking out, but talking in accents helps. Anyways, if you want to like join me on this seven months celibacy going into 2025, um, the 30 days finishes on December 26th. <laughs> I'm looking at the monitor because it's 26, you got this. But what we'll be doing is seven months of 30 days. Because like I said earlier, I don't get the fucking calendar. It doesn't make sense to me. So I'm gonna do it by how it feels good for me. And then if I wanna go into the new year, then cool. But I've got some big dreams. I also dream of having like a like an emergency fund. Like I really am desiring multiple streams of income so I could just create this like financial stability within myself. And so just like choosing to like meditate and like be on the sober. Yo, I feel like I need to be sober too. Let's be real. We're gonna go sober celibacy for seven months. It's not that long, but it feels like my, <laughs> Is that 1644 on the screen? But, um, like, I, I'm freaking out, but it's, like, really not that long. And, like, the spectrum of life, seven months is, like, so chill. And, like, maybe I'll go a year. But, like, at least give yourself these 30 days. 30 days. <laughs> we'll start one day at a time. Take one step at a time. There's no need to rush. It's like learning to fly or falling in love. <laughs> she did not just break out in Jordan Sparks out of nowhere. Okay, anyways, I don't know if anyone is going to be with me on this journey, but if you want to, let me know in the comments. We might even have, like, me and my bestie are going to have, like, bi-weekly meetings, and, like, that will be private. But, like, dude, if enough of you guys want to, like, <laughs> check in with each other weekly, <laughs> bi-weekly, and be like, yo, dude, how's it going? It'd be really funny and fun to have more accountability partners. I am not missing out on anything. I am choosing to remember the parts of me within that are powerful and calling all the energy back to me and returning all of the negative energy back to wherever it came from. <sighs> okay. Thank you so much for being here with me on these journeys. Um, I think this will be the first video that I post with this, but just know that like, I'm doing my best. I'm putting medicine on it. It looks, you'll see it like, this is the best state as, but like the other videos are from the other days. Anyways, like, it's not like, oh my God, it got worse. Like, I just probably uploaded those ones later. Okay, anyways, wherever you are, I'm giving you the biggest hug with consent. <laughs> and I hope, hey 1919, I hope that you remember ways to love yourself and be there for yourself. Because this is like feeling really uncomfortable, but I know I have to do this for myself. So yeah, I'm excited to like share with you this journey. Okay, ciao for now. Mwah. Eat you, 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 you.